The majority of American families have pets in their households. So many times when there's going to be abuse in the home, a pet is not necessarily isolated from that abuse. The abuse of pets in and of itself can be a particularly cruel form of child abuse. Studies show that upwards of 48% of victims have either delayed or refused to leave their, their abusers, even returned to their abusers out of fear for the safety of their pets. Is this something that's often overlooked? The FBI is now tracking animal cruelty in its categories of serious crimes. Many of the notorious serial killers, nearly all of the school shooters in recent years, including the Columbine school shooters, tortured and killed animals before they turned guns on their classmates. Animals as well can experience trauma and Absolutely. Shock. When an animal is being targeted in a home, it's either very likely the human is next or that the abuser is going to continue to abuse that animal as a means of terrorizing, controlling, whether a partner or a child in that home. 